Yo, yeah, what's up everybody? Lama here. I don't know if you can hear me too good. Um, I'm using the built-in mic on my computer, so I got a uh, one of those Xbox uh, stereo headsets, whatever, like the default ones from Microsoft. I bought that and I was going to try to record with it, but apparently it's not. It's detecting it as headphones, but like the microphone won't come in on my computer, so I can't use it. So go ahead and try this built-in mic. Hopefully the quality will not sound too crappy. If it does, I'll probably just redo this. But anyways, I'm playing some uh, Halo Master Chief Collection, and this is actually from the original Halo collector's edition one which I have never played the multiplayer for at all in this game I don't think I think it was before there was Xbox Live so this is like a, a split screen game you can see how bad the graphics look but they uh, I think they just kinda upped the quality and stuff they weren't doing too much to um, try and make this thing look gorgeous since there was so much they had to do but anyways this game is really cool so I've been playing it for a few hours today the multiplayer I played uh, some of the story yesterday I forgot how awful the story was for uh, the original Halo game it's like so repetitive it's like the same map you just go like up like five levels and they all look the same as each floor and then you have to like kill the main enemy and then go down five and it's just like that for every level and there's ten in that so far but there's all four Halo games in this so it's pretty cool um, the servers for this game, I know people are saying they sucked, and um, so the rankings aren't working correctly. Like, you know, you have like the skill uh, rank where it puts you, sort of like skill based matchmaking in Call of Duty, only Halo's always had it where they put you in with people on your skill. Although, in Call of Duty, it is annoying, in Halo, you kind of need that, because <laughs> uh, if not, you're going to get destroyed. It's not a game like Call of Duty where you can just run up and kill four people from behind since they've got all the. Uh, Aver shields and stuff. The pistol on this one absolutely destroys. Like I said, I've been having a lot of fun with this. If you get the Xbox One and don't have the game, I'd recommend picking it up just for the campaign alone. It's all four Halo games. The multiplayer, it's working pretty well. So the only bad thing I'll have to say, I'll search for a game here. I just search for Team Slayer, and it was uh, all the maps from Halo One to uh, Three, I think. I don't think it had Halo Four in the uh, classic Team Slayer playlist. But um, it'll take anywhere from two to five minutes to find the game, which it is annoying when it takes like up to five minutes to find the game. That's the only thing. And then the other only downfall is after I finish this game, you know how normally in like Call of Duty and stuff, how uh, it'll keep everyone in the lobby, say uh, like two people quit, so I just have to uh, get two more people to join, and then it'll find the game really quick. Not in this game. After every game is over, it backs you out to the main menu of the multiplayer, and then you have to search for another game. So it makes the matchmaking take a little bit longer, but it actually is working. Like I said, I would complain that it takes a little bit too long to find a game, but I think five minutes is the most I've had to wait so far. And then, um, I don't know, PSN. I don't know if PSN's still done or not. I was about to buy a PS4. Um, I think I'm going to get one for MLB The Show 15 anyways, but their network, dude, how are they just like... Like, I get that it's down and stuff, but why the hell are they not telling people what's wrong? I know they got DDoSed, Xbox got DDoSed too, and they put, turned uh, their servers off and fixed it, but PlayStation just keeps saying on their, uh, like, Twitter and stuff, they're like, oh, we'll be back up shortly, some users are having problems with it. It's like, dude, why can't they just come out and say, like, our shit got, uh, wrecked by people just flooding traffic to it, and they can't, like, they won't give anybody a timetable or anything, and they, like, don't even acknowledge that they got DDoSed, it's like really weird like I don't know if Microsoft did it or not but I guess they don't have to since their servers came up but it's kinda weird it's like dude Sony you're pissing a lot of people off man you guys gotta give a timetable or something but I guess the PS3 and the Vita came back so uh hopefully the PS4 will come back for guys who get that for uh, Christmas cause it does kinda suck getting a uh, new console I know some people who got PS4's and they can't even create an account and stuff to uh, play any game so it's just kind of uh sitting there taunting them and those uh laser squad dudes are fucking assholes whoever uh decided to attack the thing, and I guess that all their information got leaked online, so hopefully they get fucking sued or jailed or some shit like that, because I really don't get the point. If you just want to fuck with uh, Microsoft and Sony, it's fine, but it's like, why are you, uh, just, like, being assholes and making it so, like, normal people can't play a game, like, parents and stuff work, uh, to get their kids Christmas presents, and they just fucking, three days later, they still can't play them if you're on PlayStation, so it's really douchey what they're doing. Hopefully they get fucking... Well, I guess they, I don't know how they didn't get caught, I guess one of their dudes got caught swatting, which is like, um, I don't know, I guess you can see how it, I don't find it funny to like, uh, DDoS their servers and crash their network, but, um, it's not like real damage, but swatting is fucking retarded, cause what if somebody like, uh, say, uh, FPS Russia or FPS Kyle, you got a guy like that who just got guns laying around this house and stuff like that, and that dude's got like assault rifles and stuff, what if he was to, uh, livestream and he gets swatted cause someone gets his IP address, if cops go in and see assault rifles, they're gonna fucking kill them, because they just, what, what did they just kill that last, uh, black guy at a gas station, because he pulled a gun out, they shot him immediately, I think the footage was on YouTube, so, when somebody gets killed from swatting, it's like, I don't know, it's gonna be fucked up, and I just think they need to, uh, 
try to, um, I don't know, just fucking make an example out of the dude they caught and actually jail him for a fucking good while and fuck up his life. Um, because actually there's a difference between swatting and, uh, what did Woody's gamer tag try to, like, jail a kid for, um, making a refund on a donation or something, but, I don't know. That was my thoughts. And this is gonna be on Halo, but apparently it was more on the, uh, Lizard Squad and stuff like that. Also, um, Keemstar is fucking killing it with Lizard Squad. That dude's getting like 300,000 views a video in the past uh, few videos, so he's doing well. But final score with this is what, uh, 9 and 8? Wow, I sucked that game. <laughs> Thought I did way better than that, but um, apparently not. But fun little game, so uh, more Halo and stuff like that coming up. Thanks for uh, watching.